Warning, for the safety of others and the equipment, never leave a vehicle unattended. The operator should always ensure all components are disengaged and proceed to properly shut off all equipment before driving off. The following procedures we're about to show in this video are in place to prevent any damage if the equipment is left on. This procedure should never be used as an option to turn equipment on and off regularly. Engine and accessory would not be responsible for any damage or labor expenses caused to the components due to improper equipment handling. Good morning guys, RJ here again. Uh, this morning I'm going to do a couple of small clips on the safety of the pump and why we have the low air sender in the system. Uh, first thing we're going to do is show you where the low air sender is located. So the low air sender on this truck is So this video is um, how the, the low air sender works when you try to drive off with the vacuum system on or the jetter system on. So as you, when you get to the job site, you're already going to have your park brake engaged so your system will have power to it. At this point, you got to your job site, your, your system is engaged, your park brake is engaged and you have power your system. Now I'm going to show you what happens when you try to drive off with the system on. I never got out the truck. This is the case in, in a situation if the system is on and the driver tries to drive off with the equipment on. Okay. 